Well, a warm welcome back. We're taking a look at the Dessau Palace Museum, which after years of construction is finally open. Or will be shortly. I don't think they haven't quite set a date yet. But it's uh, a great find where there were ruins going all the way back to the uh, 1100s, they reckon. Southern Song Dynasty. Probably well worth a look if you're in the area. This is certainly worth a look, this upcoming match. Tunjung versus Kim Goan, because there is much riding on it. Tunjung is out, but that's the only thing we know for certain. If Kim wins, she goes through and as top of the group. If she loses, then Tai Zhu Yun will go through with the world number one, Han Se Yun. And it's all a bit complicated, but that's effectively where we are with the various permutations. One win and one defeat so far for Kim. and Se Young in straight games to start off with. They lost to Tai Zhu Ying in three games, 21-11 in the third. Officials now safely on court, as you can see, which means the players won't be far behind. So, Gluer Tinshuk comes out first. Just trying to re-establish a bit of pride, you would imagine, today after two straight game defeats. And she's followed by the uh, much improved Kim Garden. in 2016. When they were both juniors, in fact, Gregoria Tinchuk was the world junior champion. In 2017, she actually beat Han Yue in the final. We're gonna see Han Yue next on center court, after, or on court one after this match. Seventh in the world is her best. She's got to three World Tour finals this year, although just a feeling maybe that her form has kind of petered out a little bit. Well, she did win the Japan Masters last month, runner-up to Yamaguchi in the uh, Malaysia Masters. But there you see those two defeats, albeit against two absolute top players, in Ansa Yim and Tai Zhu Yin, 45 and 43 minutes respectively. And on the other side of the net. Kim, Kim Gohan, 25 years of age, ranked at 13 in the world. She won a, a World Junior Bronze the year before. Tunjung won the World Junior Championship title. Kim actually lost to Chen Yufei in the uh, semi-final that year. On her first Super 300 this year, just last month, that's in Korea also reached finals in Australia and the United States. There's that victory over Anse Young and the three-game defeat.
against Tai Zhu Ying. I don't think, Steen, that Tai Zhu Ying needs to be worried about Gregoria Tunjung's motivation, does she? I think, I think simple pride is, is, is enough. You want to come right away with at least way. one win. Definitely. Want to finish the year on a high note. Definitely been a good year for her so far. Lusferis of Latvia is the chair umpire. Simon Oman Fung from Hong Kong is the service judge. Ladies and gentlemen, on my right, Gregoria Mariska Tunyung, Indonesia. And on my left, Kim Ga Eung, Korea. Gregoria Mariska Tunyung to serve. Love all, play. on the first rally there. Oh. There's a lot, of, so it's a over. lot at stake for Kim Go when One she got four. into these um, World Tour Finals. After withdrawal from um, Akane Yamaguchi. And uh, an opportunity for oh. her to earn so crucial uh, points Two, for the uh, qualification list for Paris. Currently 10th uh, and definitely wants to stay in top 16 to qualify for the Olympics alongside so um, over. An Se Young. Two, all. And 10 looks uh, so it's over. pretty safe within top 16, Three, but um, two. it's tough competition there. Only 8,000 points between number 17 and number 10. So, semi-final points here would be, uh, at least semi-final points would be welcome for Kim Gaon. And the thing is that if she loses this match, she ends up fourth in the group. Yeah, fourth in the group, 6,600 points. And it gets to the semis, at least 8,400. Not to mention Four, the uh, money two. difference, $15,000 for finishing fourth in the group. If you qualify for the semifinals, you're guaranteed $50,000 and you still play for the 200,000. And first prize, uh, that was so efficient so against uh, Anse Young. Three, four. The cross smash is there. The other thing from Kim's point of view is when you've lost six out of six against your opponent, there's always that little bit of self-doubt. Until yeah. you finally break that duck, you're always wondering. And I think from Sun Jung's point of view, she's just got to kind of make the absolute most of it, make a bright start, which she, which she is doing, and just keep putting her opponent under pressure. Because obviously she can finish Six, she can three. finish higher than fourth in the group if she wins this match, Dean, I think, can't she? 
Who? Tun Jun finishes third yeah. if she wins the match. Yeah. yeah. So that earns her twelve and a half thousand dollars more than she'd get for fourth. Exactly. And more uh, more, more points, points as well. Yeah. So it's over four six. And also continues the stronghold that she's had on uh, Kim Go. Yeah. Yeah. So she's got plenty of motivation here. Good shot, though. Five, six. Delightful from the Indonesian. Service over seven, five. Oh, that's a good spin. Serves over six nine. What a very purposeful start from the Indonesian. Five points clear at the mid-game break, and much for Kim to ponder. Tai Su Ying will also be, if she's watching this, reasonably happy with the way it's gone so far. She looks very, very uh, well tense six. to me. Kim Cohn. from uh, day one when she met a player she knew 
from practice, even though she's the world's best player this year. Kim Gaon was familiar with it. Now she's playing a player that she's had difficulties coping with that's gone long. Wow. 40, six. She just looks a little bewildered at the moment, doesn't she? Yeah. The Korean. Oh, that's a good shot. Oh. What an angle that was. Six Ridiculous. Six. That pretty much sums this first game up so far. For the two players, everything's gone uh, Tun Jung's way. Seven. Well, stops the rock, but surely too little too late from Kim's point of view. Good follow-up from Kim there. Nine, seven, Super important that she gets a game going here in the first game, scoring a, a few extra points. So it's believable in the uh, second game. So there's something to give a little bit of confidence on the comeback. Rally and another confidence builder for Kim. Yeah, best rally of the match. 10, 17. I know it's not a new thing, Steen, to see players with uh, taped up legs and shoulders and whatever, but there seems an extraordinary amount of tape on these players this year. Yeah. End of a hard Thank season. You. Yeah, I think there's. There's a lot of factors in this. The Olympic qualification period, Asian Games that was postponed from last year. Um, 17. And sort of um, a, a, a certain uncertainty from uh, 2019 when the Olympic qualification was uh, broken up following the uh, pandemic. So I think the... Um, Attitude has been let's just play as much as possible so in the uh, early stages. 18, 10. See if we can uh, secure ourselves a good um, position, but it comes with a price. It's just Change it. the problem is you, you only uh, realize it when you have to pay it. And we've got Sindhu out with um, injury, we've got Rachinag out. 
We have had Anse Jung out for a month. Akan Yamaguchi is withdrawn from this tournament here. So uh, I think both players and, and um, so organizations so need to uh, realize that they, they need to plan better in terms of uh, what tournaments are priority tournaments and um, and where you have to have uh, focus on uh, on practice, even though you're perhaps uh, competing. Yeah, tournament management such so a such a vital 19, thing in, 11. in collaboration with uh, coaches and other other members of each player's team. But meanwhile, a couple more points required for Junk to take this opening game. Serves over 12 19. She's definitely loosened 13, up, um, Kim Gaon. Oi, oi, oi. 14, 19. Well, some kind of miss hit from uh, Chun Jung. Yeah, just keeping the Indonesian honest here. She's got to get over the line. Kim's not going to make it straight forward. So that error 20. gives Victoria to jump six chances to get a nose in front here. Sums up the first game. game. Should have been an easy kill. First game on the Kim. She missed it. And 21, 21 points to 14. Gregoria Tunjung takes the Ope, do and I could have sworn I heard a smashing of applause from Tai Zhu Ying somewhere in the bowels of the building. Court one, 20 seconds. Court one, 20 seconds. Court 
Second game, level, play. I think this is going to be fascinating because there were definitely signs towards the end of that first game that Kim Gohan was Set over. starting One to find a feet level. in the match. Still too many unforced errors, but it looked a little more promising than it was in the early stages when uh, Sun Jung was just all over like a rash. Yeah. So it's over. And now there's One not so much to debate. There's no more free games. It's win the last two games to get in. Wasn't that worth a challenge? Two, Looked one. close, didn't it? Yeah. Gregorio Moritzka Tunjung playing with the drift here in the Three, second game. One. And perhaps that can give some confidence to Kim Gohan that she's playing up against the drift and can uh, really punch her shots to the back line. The problem is, can she get the right length if she's under pressure? Four, one. Dreadful start for uh, Chun Jung. Yeah. Easy mistakes. These are just bonus points, really, for Kim. Yeah. Hasn't done much yet in this game, and she's got herself in front. Another easy mistake. Five, Five one. one. Excellent. Six, one. Serves over. Two, six. Oh, yeah, nice angle. angle. Three, six. Well, there's a heavy strapping on the uh, left calf of um, Kim Gohan as well. We know because we've seen the other matches here Four, that um, the shuttles are a bit slow. So even though you're playing with the drift, you can uh, push your shots and put your opponent under pressure, making it difficult for her to get the right length on uh, on her shots and thus creating some uh, attacking opportunities. These um, soft shots. It can be dangerous. Serves over. Seven. Four. And slow playing conditions. A bit of raw power is uh, not to be underestimated. Certainly had Four. a few freebies in the second game yeah, so far. That, that shot, that clear, that's that's a poor clear. And another one. Nine. Four. Marisca is that 
four. Her hitting movement, her overhead hitting movement is with such a big swing. Makes it more difficult to control than if you're able to play it with a little bit uh, so over. shorter swing. Want Five. to move the uh, control from the uh, shoulder out to the fingers. Six, ten. So, so a five-point lead for Kim Garten at the mid-game break, albeit that at least half of those points and must have been donated by uh, Tung Jun. Perhaps she'll take it. 11-6. Twenty seconds. Twenty seconds. Eleven six. Good deception. right because the line judge would have had a pretty good view of going that fast and it was clearly long challenge unsuccessful one challenge remaining service over 7 11 play sneaked in a little commercial there our umpire good shot over 12 7 wow Kim this one might have more chance of being reversed second Time she's challenged in the space of three points. Let's have a look what Hawkeye says on this one. Yeah. Correction in thirty seven. Play. Feeling that Sorry. nerves are uh, it. creeping in on Kim Gaon again. I think it's super important for her to keep this three, four point cushion at least. Oh. 
Good leave from uh, Tinjun, who's Ten, trying to get herself 13. back into this. Ready, Tinjun. Yeah, thank you. Ten, thirteen. Do it 11, when you're certainly. playing with the drift. You've got to attack on those chances. You get to attack a little bit more than you possibly prefer because it's too difficult to uh, punch the clears if your opponent plays just a little bit short. There from uh, Kim. 14, 12. It's super valuable because it um, should uh, keep Chun Jung from uh, attacking too much to that side. Fifteen, twelve. Like she might have ridden out the storm. Kim. Yeah. Excellent. Seventeen, twelve. Well, she's challenging that because there was no call of out. No. She thinks there should have been. Clip the line, so. Challenge unsuccessful. In a great position now to potentially level the match in the next uh, couple of minutes or so. Grigora Mariska challenges called out. So successive challenges. First one didn't work. Let's see whether this one fares any better. that point but she's Play. got a lot of work to do still
and this time Kim wants to have a look just to see whether that clipped the sideline. Called out. I think it was close. Yeah. But it did miss. So now, to three points. No challenges remaining. 15, 18. Play. Point coming up here. If she can get it back to within two. So a few seeds of doubt in Kim's head. Service over. 19, 15. Super important the next two rallies. Oh. 17, 19. Was a nervy one yeah. from Kim. 18, 19. Really Play. was. Play. Out. When it's this close, you always want a second opinion. 18 12, she had at one point. 19 all. What about nerve now? Imagine how tired you Ying's feeling. to the net, and here is a match point for Wait, Gregoria Tunchung, and also a point to put Tai Zhu Ying into the semi-finals. What a turnaround here. If she can hold it together for one more point right now. She must wonder what on earth is going on. Looked to certainty to win this game a few minutes ago. Was an impressive point from Kim. So easy to snatch at those shots when the match point down. Still has to get herself out of a hole here, though. Oh, he's landed well in. Complete misjudgment. That was, wasn't it? I think she lost the bearings actually yeah. as to where she was on the court. Oh, hey, what a shot! 
It's dropped in and we're going to a third game. Absolutely incredible finale for that second game. Kim wins it, keeps her hopes alive, and it's one. Thank you. Final game, level. Play. Well, who knows in what or in which direction this match is going to go next. That's an absolutely Two. delicious angle. Tintrin found there. Deception to uh, bamboozle Kim. Love. Super important here Wait. who uh, gets the first good shot in, so to speak, uh, who uh, can put the opponent under pressure first in the rally. Oh, she's nailed that. So it's over. One, three. Beautifully, Kim Gaon intercepting very short uh, cross from um, Ginting, not Ginting, Tunjung. And 
another chance goes so Peggy. Over. She did the hard part. Four. She set yeah. up the chance. She Three. got there. Didn't have to go anywhere near the line because Tuchin was never getting that. They put it wide. Yeah, I would challenge that as well. challenges called out. I think she was one for two in the last game in terms of challenges. Let's see about this one. Yeah, a big piece of the line. Correction in five, three. Play. Service over four five. one of the things where I feel Tun Jun can become uh, stronger putting the attack away from the front court converting more Six, of her uh, opportunities Come here. I can do nothing with that. Yeah. Play a letter. Six all. Straight that one. Seven, yeah. six. Having the initiative um, from the opening of the rally, pretty much there. Kim Gone. See how long it took for Tun Jung to break in that uh, backhand side. Had to use a lot of small extra steps, and extra steps cost time. Set us over. Seven all changes.
11. That was something the audience liked, the challenges there at the net, playing back at each other. It's not been a match of lengthy rallies, that's for sure. Pulled that again. Yeah. Service over. Eight all. It's been a match of um, a lot of mistakes. Both players have um, gone for um, the lines. Yeah, there have been a lot of errors, but it doesn't feel like a war of attrition, does it? It feels like quite an entertaining match, actually. Among the errors, there have been some absolute. Yeah, because it's. it's I mean, Kim Goon, no doubt about it, is is nervous. Nine, eight. And this shot here, that's probably uh, a bit more defensive than uh, she actually tried to play it, Tun Jun. Ten, eight. Yeah, nothing she could do about that. Tun Jun. Retrieval. Ten all. Just has the feeling this game's going to go to the wire. <laughs> yeah, exactly. They've had two of their previous uh, six matches decided by um, the narrowest of margin in. Um, Ten all. The third game, well, that's not true because the narrowest is 30-29, uh, but it's been with two points. Both of them in favor of uh, Chun Chun. <laughs> so, mid-game break, Eleven just a single point interval. between them. And Tai Zhu Ying at the moment will be a very nervous spectator. She's praying for a Tung Chung victory. Possible to predict which direction this match is going to go in next. Well, 
10. This doesn't bode well for Kim Gone the way she started here. She's looked pretty nervous right from the start, I think, Steena. Yeah, and, and then it eased off a little bit after she'd lost the first game. But in the uh, closing phase of the second, it resurfaced. Question mark is what's going to happen here? Another unforced error. 14, 10. Sometimes the sensation of being nervous is so unpleasant that you, you you want it to go away. You want to know whether you win the rally or lose it, and, and that makes you go for the uh, uh, risky shots where it's either a winner or a loser. There's another one. Yeah. 15, 10. So the ability to endure the unpleasant feeling of... Um, Nervousness is super, super important. And right now, Kim Gaon most likely ten. feels that whatever co corner she's covering, it's going to be the wrong one. Yes, and of course, the errors that she's made in this game in the last, well, couple of minutes, all they've done is fired Tun Jung there with, with confidence. And you see your opponent really struggling. Yeah. Landed in, well in. Slump of the shoulders, and suddenly there's a seven-point seven gap ten. on the scoreboard. That affect uh, Tun Jung. I think it does. Well, seventeen. That I'm, I'm not sure this challenge is going to uh, have any joy. No, that was a bad um, cross from uh, Tun Jun, but a great interception from Kim Gong. Plum on the line. Challenge unsuccessful. One challenge remaining. 13-17. Well, we saw the near Kim capitulation in the second game. Play. She was a country mile ahead and just about hung on, saved a match point. Yeah. So, same thing going to afflict Sun Jung here. Yeah, you, you can't rule anything out. Oh. Yeah, good spotted. 14-17. Thank you. 14, 17. Service 
18-14. Well taken by uh, the Indonesian, staying there. Closing down the uh, net. She's hanging in there, Kim Kohn. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. Just approaching the hour mark in the match. 15, 18. Missed it. 16, 18. It's almost going to be decided this on who makes the fewest mistakes from here on. Yeah, that, that's the thing. That's the thing. That's better. That's got up to within two of the finishing line. 19, 16. Krugoria Tunjun. Just want get the feeling she wants to kind of crawl over the line here, <laughs> but uh, that doesn't often happen. Huge point this one. A little jerky action, and here are three match 20, points. Match point 17. To knock Kim out of the event and to ensure that Tai Zuyin will be in. Play. She knows her fate here. If this hits the line, and it has, and that's the end of it. And a match where she would have had such high hopes to start with, Kim Gohan, has ended in defeat, 21-17 in the third. And what it means is that she will actually finish bottom of the group Gregoria Tunjung finishes third. And Si Young wins the group. Tai Si Young goes through with her. Uh, just over an hour on court. In a match that maybe wasn't at the absolute highest quality, but still provided an extraordinary amount of drama. Tunjung's first victory of these World Tour Finals, enough to send Kim spinning out of the championship, and it would have been, well, a horrible way to lose the match, really, with a misjudgment like that. Tunjuk wins 21-14, 20-22, One hour and three minutes, the match time.
One more match to come in our first session on court one. Pride at stake, also prize money and ranking points. And UA against Beiwen Zhang is next. <laughs>